six disturbing videos from around the internet. All right. It's already disturbing. I'm not gonna lie, bro. I would never, I, Chad, I would never drive at night. Don't say it, Chad. Don't say it. Holy shit. Is that Riley Reed's coochie? First video on Avid Cave Explorer on YouTube. You can't even drive. You see, I knew it was gonna come, bro. Known by the channel name Exploring Abandoned Mines and Unusual Places is exploring an abandoned mine for the simple purpose of reviewing a flashlight. Chad, these, this is a live rep representation of how it would be to link with a girl that does OnlyFans. I promise you. During the video, you can hear as the explorer goes into detail about the flashlight. And All right. Demonstrates its use in the mine he's exploring. However and that's your first mistake. What are you doing? You're not going to find diamond, buddy. This is not Minecraft. Leave. For, while talking to the camera about both the mine and the flashlight he's reviewing, the explorer hears what he first thinks to be wind blowing through the mine. Okay. Though many believe the audio sounds like a very disturbing whispering or talking sound. Let me hear it. Okay, this is a review and demonstration of the Through Night uh, TN12 handheld flashlight that you see here. Okay, that's the portal to the wall deck mine. I'm okay. inside. The wind has kind of died down a little bit and it's not raining, so I managed to stay dry. Of course, I'm inside this little uh, alcove kind of, but anyway, you come to- All right, my nigga, can I hear the scream? My nigga, I want to determine if it's a moan or a scream. Down this little incline. That's going to depend if I discover the, the cave or, or go out. Path, and then big boulders here you have to climb over, and then the tunnel's right behind me uh, this way. So let's uh, check it out. Um, let's get in here. And uh, like I said, this light has five Nigga, did I hear a buggy drop? Your chat, do y'all hear anything? Levels. I believe it's on medium right now, which is level three. So this would be high. And this would be turbo, which is really bright. And then this is firefly, which is hardly anything. Okay. And then that would be low. And then medium. Medium seems to be the best. Money, can one. we get to the scary not shit? Not too bright, not too dim. Okay. And then uh, you can see how big these timbers are. Those are that's about almost a foot. Your chat, are y'all hearing anything? In diameter. I don't hear anything. Big cross timber, so they had to put big ones in here to hold up all of this rock. You can see right here where, where some of these boards are bending. All right, Monica, you're yeah. yapping. Holy shit. Sounds like uh, a monster finger herself. Keep going, bro. You're about to strike gold, bro. You're about to see a double thicked up monster cheeked up. Dude, I'm telling you, just go. You're, you're about to, yeah, yep. You're about to see Bloody Mary double cheeked up. Oh, hell no, hell no, hell no. That don't even sound like one monster. Nigga, that sound like three. If you don't run. What, is that wind? Does that sound like wind to you? Huh, Helen Keller? Clear your ears, buddy. Nigga need Can Mr. Beast to do the surgery on him. You see, you see, Chad, I could hear in his voice. He's not black. Chad, if he was black, the first little decibel of sound he would have heard to his, his ear, he would have spread to like Usain Bolt. But now this nigga want to act like he, uh, I don't know, like he in National Ge Geographic, bro. Motherfucker, what wind does that sound like? You hear that? Yes, we hear it. Stopped. So leave! He's keep, dude. You're chatting. Well, I don't know what that is. That doesn't sound like wind, but that's crazy. Yes, run now. I don't know if that's a bird or I don't know what that is. It almost sounds like snakes, but. Chad, at this point, I, I want three monsters to come out there and scare him, bro, because this man is annoying me. Wow. I've heard some weird stuff in mines, but that is definitely creepy. I don't know what that is. So let's get out of here and uh, head back out to the portal. Um, that was weird. Now he dumb as hell. I'm not going to lie, bro. You're dumb. These come from the You're same talk. exploring YouTube channel shown earlier. Okay. This time, however, the explorer visits an abandoned, supposedly haunted mine in Nevada. Yo, nigga, who's nigga? Holy shit, are niggas diarrheaing here? What type of nasty ass substance this is? Known as Horton Mine. The first time he visits, he claims to feel negative energy coming from the mine, and what he witnesses goes to support his claim. Okay. okay. With the popularity of the first visit, the YouTuber okay. decides to visit the abandoned mine a second time. You see, chat? That's the problem with niggas, bro. That's the problem with niggas, bro.
Yo, JCW, I appreciate the five gifties, bro. Thank you very much, man. Though you love right there, bro. Appreciate you, man. That's the problem with niggas, bro. You're going like 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 you find out that there's creepy noise in, in the cave. And you wanna and you wanna visit it again. Do you wanna die? This time hearing something very disturbing. Here are both of those visits to the mine. Okay, here's a lower edit at the Victorine mine. I believe this was an older mine. Okay, yeah, that definitely looks like a coochie, bro. That once they dug the upper tunnels, this got incorporated into the same uh, claim or whatever. Okay, we can go in here and just take a quick look. I don't think I'm going to explore this particular mine. There's a little bit too much water in, in here. and uh, Yeah, because it's, it's a coochie, bro. Really old, but, uh, yeah, water in a mine. I do see other footprints here in the uh, mud. But uh, I just don't think it's wise to go in here. Okay. Water. Okay. I avoid this if I can. I don't think it's wise to go in there, Chad. What does he proceed to do? Go in there, bro. I don't care what happens to you. Yeah, this looks pretty uh, sketchy. Yo, nigga, did I just see Slender Man, nigga? Some nigga just hit the dab. Some nigga just hit the nay nay real quick. I'm not tweaking, right? I'm not tweaking, right? Nigga, is that Webin Yama? That gotta be Webin Yama, bro. Oh, it's just the top. Yo, bro, I'm stupid. No, but why is it moving, though? I thought, I swear, I thought it was an actual person. Yo, bro. Back there. No, but who, yo, who put chains in here, bro? Whoever owned this gotta had a, like some sort of plantation, bro. This is probably where Rod was born. It's probably where Waka and Tommy were born, bro. Yeah, this mine definitely has a very spooky vibe to it. So I'm gonna head back out and check out the other stuff that's here. This is just too wet, too muddy. Okay. Um, and obviously something is creepy making the chains uh, swing. So time to get the hell out of here. Yes, please do so. All right, your second visit, what happens? Nigga, is that a bear? That's how far I've come. Okay, here's a final parting shot of the end of the Horton Tunnel. And, uh... Is the nigga taking a shower? Like, what is that noise? There's the, uh, ore pass. With all the cascading water. And, um... What the f*** is that? Motherfucker, that's Five Nights at Freddy's. That's what it is, nigga. That's, nigga, that's Five Nights at a cave. If you don't run... Yo, chat, was that light there before? Ew, nigga, who, nigga, who shit it like this, bruh? During the storm, Clem took a video from the top floor of his house as he saw the giant tornado get closer. Clem nigga, thought the tornado run. would miss his house, when in fact it was coming directly towards him, all while he was still recording. Unfortunately, Clem's wife would pass away because of the intensity of the tornado, while Clem would receive a terrible spine injury. Well, I wonder why! I mean, this shit is approaching you, it's approaching you at 600 miles per hour, and, and instead of running for your life, you want to record? Dude, this is not Twitch! That's not the right way you get viewers! The phone he took the video on was later discovered in the rubble of his home, and this is what the video was able to capture. Yo, chat, he thought he could, he, he, he thought he could survive the, the... What did they call it? The the eye of the tornado? Dude, you're dumb. Why would you do this, bro? Why would you do this to yourself? R.I.P. his girl, though. That sucks. Imagine your wife died to a tornado, and you could have left that shit. Bro thinks he's on creative mode. <laughs> Yo! 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 And he's still recording, bro! This next video shows a man exploring the Paris Catacombs, which is a place very well known for causing people to get lost. There okay, this person got a little too lost. Is this, is this, some, is this a bunchy? They're essentially the most complex series of tunnels in the world. Definitely not right. somewhere you'd want to find yourself exploring with Throwing it back as a skeleton is crazy. The video shows this man getting lost and going into a full panic run as he doesn't know where to go to get out. This nigga in the back rooms, bro. The man was never found, but his camera later was with no trace of the guy. Damn! 
these arrows point in a direction. In the, okay, leave it. Occasionally also, he stops to photograph roomfuls of bones, which means that he's very, very deep inside the catacombs. So basically, he's- Yo, I'm a little scared. I'm a little scared. I ain't even gonna lie. I'm a little scared. Other than the point of view shots, or pictures of human bones. The catacombs for centuries. So it is possible with these paintings uh, that we may be able- That is not a painting, bro. An old skeleton is throwing his ass back at you. That is real. ...to be traced by itinerary to some extent. After going deeper into the catacombs, and all of a sudden, we hear his breathing get louder and louder, uh, as though something was scaring him. He was, he's, he's frightened, he's frightened. Occasionally he stops, perhaps, to try to decide which way to run among all the many different corridors. He's running faster and faster and faster, deeper and deeper into the catacombs. Wait. All of a sudden. Wax the frail. Love y'all. And peace.